We're Americans, so they don't count when they're cracked, right? <gasps> oh, coffee and nose. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't expecting such a brutal rebuttal. This is right now the Hello everyone, and welcome to Enigma's new Cold War server for DCS World. Uh, I hadn't actually heard about this one until some people on T-Rex's Discord channel started talking about it, but it looked like a lot of fun, so I jumped in. Now, I don't really have that many Cold War aircraft, but I do have Flaming Cliffs, and the A-10A is part of the plane set on this server. And so after a bit of practice in the A-10A to get used to it as a downgrade of the A-10C, I felt confident enough to jump in. So the idea of the server is it's a dynamic map, kind of similar to Finnish virtual pilots on um, IL-2, where the front line moves back and forth depending on how well you do, your side does. Um, you've got various targets, so other players, as well as um, NPCs, both NPC aircraft that you can take down, and ground bases that you can attack. And so that really appeals to me. I like that kind of dynamic thing. I like the mix of PvP and PvE, so there's always something there for you to do, even if it's a bit of a quiet day. So I was very happy to see this, very happy to give it a try. So here I am with T-Rex and N.A. Hardy. They're both giving me escorts in their F5s, uh, while I trundle along in my A-10, uh, seemingly mostly oblivious to what's going on around me. So we'll skip ahead a little bit until I'm just coming up to the first enemy base that we encounter. Uh, Kevin? Yep. There's something maneuvering and pulling a lot of G's and firing a lot of rounds in you. Not near near you, but it fired a lot of red traces. Okay, I'm trying to keep an eye out. A uh, rifle. Parachutes on your right? Yeah, they are. Rifle. Oh, yeah. Good launch. Rifle. Pig 2-1, Overlord 1-1. One, one. Overlord 1-1. Request for 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 I think I can see some frontline units here. Yeah, the things that I just launched. Are. Yeah, I'm taking I'm taking ground fire. I need to yep, adjust the position. Back. Okay, the things I launched right. at, I think we're already dead. Uh, getting locked. Air targets. Getting, getting locked. Yep. Hardy, do you remember what the thing is for the CCIP? Uh, if you said it's a... M I, I don't think there is a CCIP. I know that there's a like gyrocyte, but I think the way the bombs work is that you set manual and then set a certain amount of Ooh. depression. In the F5? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, so manual... Overlord, one, one. Yeah, depression. Oh yeah, 20 degrees. Okay, right, so... I personally just set it to manual and eyeball the motherfucker in a... In a uh, just a steep dive. There's a lot of firing oh, fuck, down below fuck, fuck, me. Fuck, I'm on fire, I'm on fire. I've got to reject. Yeah, I got shilkered. God damn it. Pig two one, overlord one one, bra one zero two, 
I wish I wish they'd have the A first so we could go do seed. Ah, I got clipped. Yeah, I did. Okay, so I did shoot at the enemy, and it was blowing up. I was just looking in the wrong place. Uh, but yeah, I took out two of the buildings on the outpost. Uh, well, the shulker clipped me enough that I couldn't pull out the dive. Okay, I'll say that's semi-successful. I'm all armed and turned on. What, well, hey? It's the other way around, but the more you know. T-Rex, I'm very sorry, I might have gotten you killed last time. Ah, uh, you're welcome. Four, three, one, overlord, one, one, <laughs> three, zero, five, four, 40, at 25,000, cold. Hi, Kevin. Hi, you want me to take off first? Yep, you can go first. Awesome. Look at this, Thank you. Look at this little formation. Hi, Kevin. Yeah, I, I sort right. of fell out, I'm trying to get back in. Like are you, are you going flat out? Are, are you doing flat out? Are you going flat out there, Kevin? Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, I always fly <laughs> this just flat out. I can hear his engines screaming. They're fuel efficient. Be nice. I think I've pulled ahead. Have I pulled ahead? Oh no, I'm behind. I'm lagging behind. You're lagging behind Shit. a warp lock. Yeah, that that's embarrassing. Yeah. I didn't do the bearing, but we got uh, two ship fish bed hot coming in. Oh god. Yeah, right. I see. Is it is it just off our 12 o'clock? It's low over the city, if so. It could be, yeah. I can't remember what the uh, bearing was. Pink 2 1, Overlord 1 1, Bra 0 9 8 4 110 at 30,000. I see another ray turn low. Uh, the smoke is coming from a uh, site. Uh, uh, flat, 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 slow. Is it missile? Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah, fish bait going high on our right side. Yep. I'm jetting the audience, I'm going after it. You nearly jettisoned them on me. <laughs> I was below you. I, I did call. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's why it's my own stupid call. Oh, I think it just got blapped. Yeah, it just got blapped. Holy shit. He said it was a There's another one in the area. So, what's the other one? Uh, the other yeah. one's diving away. Missile's going into him. Oh, I see, I see. Someone just got hit. hit. I see the two way tens low. And I can't see the fish bed. Uh, one of the A-10s just fired. Something Eyes on the fish bed. Down. Eyes on the fish bed. Where is he? Where is he? Uh, he's on the A-10 that's flaring. Okay, I I think I see him. Someone's firing on him. I think that's Seraphim who's engaging him. Yeah, he's in. Flash one. Good kill, Seraphim. Roger that, that's good. You could say it was a uh, splashing. Oh, 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 I oh, oh, oh. hate you now. Yes, you he should. He got the point. He, yes. Yes, he did. Well, the good news is I didn't dump my ordnance, so I, will, I shall continue following on Kevin. That was a good kill, but it was hardly rocket science. Oh. <laughs> Don't challenge me. Wait, where's Kevin gone? Oh, there he is. I right, need to go yep. for Burner to catch up with that boy. Oh, he's on a base trying to get locked. Alright, I'm gonna set my. I think I see him. Is he, is he, is he the A10 sort of, what, 5,000 feet? Maybe a little yeah, higher? Yeah, he's just casually Very flying at, like as if nothing happened. Yeah, he just fired. Yep. Kevin, did you maneuver at all during that build fight, or did you just kind of fly right through it, not giving a shit? Uh, I looked out my window. You all seem busy. Another <laughs> session <laughs> coming in. Oh god. Alright. Roger that, does it say where he's coming from? 
Uh, my position uh, was 085, so he's coming slightly from the east. Low, 2000, I think. Single fish bed. Roger, that should be east. Yeah, yeah. Kevin, what's your fucking Yeah, I don't see the target at all. Uh, base. Uh, down. At war, one o'clock. Uh, low. Out. Ten degrees depression for me. Oh, is that where the smoke's... Yeah, where the smoke's coming from. I just got a merge call. I'll be... Shit, merge? She must have gone right through us. At one I don't target see down there. Yeah, I'm with him. I'm tangling. I still haven't got any eyes. I don't see this base. I'm on the deck. I think I was behind you guys. There's something else coming in from the east. Low. to go right over me. There's a, a little base down there. I think it's the one Kevin was firing at. Oh, He's just gone over that Friendly now. Fire, sorry. Missile out, missile Blue out, missile out. Watch oh, it. fuck, fuck, fuck. Target's flaring. It's oh, a fish bed. He's got me. Could try and bomb something. What's not ours? Bra, 101490 at 30,000. I thought really hard to see ground targets. I don't know if it's because my graphics are set up a bit Pick weird, but overlord, um, everything looks the same. I always get just little tiny black dots, so I have to keep zooming out and zooming back in on. This is why I like the Mavericks. They've got infrared cameras attached to them. I see the MiG pilot's parachute. Is it bad if I give it a bit of 20 mil? Uh, war crates. I'm American. Only if I'm they firing. See it. <laughs> it's only a war crime if you get caught. Some uh, ZSUs firing on me from the ground. I can't see it. Alright, I'm starting my uh, startup procedure again. Anything in enemy territory is like a base behind the enemy lines is gonna be enemy, right? Yes. yes. Okay, good, because I, I have about six to eight trucks that I'm going to commit war crimes on. Yeah, I, um... I think uh, you mean targets for opportunity. Yes, that. <laughs> yeah, something's firing at me from the ground. Friendly bomber it's formations to go from uh, Soki, by the way. Gonna dive in on an enemy base. Dropping our cluster bombs. I got hit there. Shit. Did you just uh, make a pass on stuff? Yeah, I just made a really low pass, pulled out, and heard something hit the bottom of my plane. Ooh, is that you? That's just been past me, or was that a... Yep, yep, that's me. Yeah, you're being shot out from the ground. Yeah, if I'm... For a second there, I thought I'd merge with a fish bed at low speed and a tight left, and thought, well, this is where I die. That's shooting. I see it's like firing at me. I'm gonna They're fire cool. back at it. I hurt him. He hurt me. My plane's beeping at me. I'm not sure what's up. I've uh, got multiple. Looks. Pig two one. Overlord one one. Bra. A sound sight to the north of me. At thirty thousand flanking. My radio is fucked. Good hits. Good hits. I'm going in for another run. Copy that. It looks like they're uh, BTRs. They're not shulkers, so that's a good thing. 
Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my wing's missing. My wing is missing. I need to RTB right now. Um, I don't think you can RTB with a missing wing. I still have most of it left, kind of, I think. Subject There's a big fireball on the end of it. It's only about half gone. The other one looks alright. There's a brain trying to make me not fly anymore. Uh, okay, where? I'm basically a big firecracker in the sky right now, so that is bad. Uh, I'm the blue smoke heading west. Um, I'm just gonna smash frontline units, I think. I accidentally just smacked my, uh, um, what's it, countermeasures button from moving my hand from the keyboard and just fired off a bunch of flares on the runway. Uh, oh. Hey, Seraphim, you're nice and close. Yeah, getting into position. Nice and, nice and blue, I like, I like your, uh, your camo. I'm alive! Oh, look at that sexy plane. Did you make it, Kev? Yeah, I did. I may have drifted off the runway, but I'm here. So far, I'm the only one of us Wait, that has managed a 100% casualty rate. So after that round, I then respawned, headed back out to the front lines. We found the server was going to end in about 15 minutes. A lot of the other guys uh, didn't take off at that point. I was close enough to the front that I decided I was going to push on and make my attack runs. So I do find a base. Just having issues reacquiring it here. This is something I really am getting used to with the A10A. Is the fact that you don't have a targeting pod that stays locked on the target between your shots. So you've got to take note of where the enemy are between your Maverick rounds. But all in all, I am getting off several shots here. Getting used to this. It's not too dissimilar from the A10C. You just have to get used to its quirks. There is a lot of missing features, uh, but really it's the targeting pod that I miss the most. The targeting pod makes a massive difference in finding enemies, keeping the enemies in sight, and making attack runs a lot more survivable. Since you're not dive bombing, you can do CCRP level release. Still, the A10A is uh, a good plane, and I had fun with this as my first flyout. And certainly the server, I've found a lot of fun. Uh, again, it's the kind of thing that I like, this mix of PvE and PvP, so that you don't have to just uh, hope that you can find another player. And even at quiet times, which I often end up playing on, you still get plenty of action here. Uh, certainly going to be on the server more going forward. Might even go and uh, get some of the more DCS uh, modules for the Cold War, mostly to use on the server. Uh, but do definitely need more practice, uh, especially with the self-preservation. Here I'm actually being locked by a MiG-19, and I'm paying zero attention to it because I'm just target-focused. Luckily, the MiG-19 either goes away or unlocks me. So it lets me continue bullying this point down here. You can see I'm getting multiple hits. I do struggle identifying my targets with the Maverick Seeker Head. 
Uh, it's nowhere near as good as the targeting pod in terms of the zoom level. So I just end up firing at all the vehicles I can see and randomly get a mix of trucks and ZSUs. That still does clear up these points quite nicely. You can see that I am taking ground fire. And since this is right near the end of the server, I'm really not worried about self-preservation. I'm just seeing how much I can do before it expires. So I take the ground fire as mostly a big bullseye to dive in on. Yeah, on these flights I have taken out the um, GPU 82s. I'm mostly using the cluster bombs just because I find them a lot easier against vehicle targets. I'm not great at pinging the vehicle targets close enough for the regular warheads. The cluster bombs are nice and easy since they just saturate an entire field. As you can see there, you don't necessarily get the kills straight away, but mostly they will critically damage whatever they hit, stop them firing back, and then eventually you get the kill. So eventually I get hit. Um, I was trespassing some six sites, so I was kind of asking for that. I possibly could have brought this back. The turbines do still seem to be working, uh, but as I said, the server is resetting soon, and so I was happy just to bail. All in all, I'm very happy with that. I ended up with uh, 15 ground kills. Uh, for two losses. And so, decent start, decent first round in the A10A. And certainly I'll be looking to play more of this. If you enjoyed this video, give this a, a like. And if you want to see more of this kind of content, consider subscribing. Uh, any questions or anything, uh, put it down below in the description, especially if you have a suggestion for a really good Cold War plane that would fit with Enigma server. Right, until next time, hope you all uh, don't forget to have fun. Cheers.